and we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to create gradient wave lines. We'll start with a simple line, use the busy tool, hold control, left click and left click again. Now copy that, press and control D. And it's a good idea to turn off the snapping. When you reposition it, always hold control. Then select control D again, reposition and repeat it until you've got enough of them. How many depends on your taste. Let me make that a little bit more dense and I copy it once more. Alright, let me resize it and now we'll go to object, align and distribute and use this distribution function down here. Now we've got the same distance. I go to object, fill and stroke, and I use, let's say five millimeters and I give it a round cap. It's a good idea to copy it in case this is not the perfect value. We can go back to this copy, use it again. So this is the first part. Second is to go to path and combine, then path and path effects. Click on a plus sign. And we want to use lattice deformation too, and then the notes tool. And now we have kind of like a mesh, and you can drag these nodes around to adjust the curve and deform your object. Once again, it's your taste that decides how it should look. Just play around with it. And when you're done, we are ready for the final step. We can give it a gradient. Just go to path, stroke to path. And then let us open the fill and stroke menu. We'll go to gradient. Use a new gradient for the fill. And then left to right. We've got two points and we can give that different colors. Right now it's black to transparent, but I want to have something like bluish to red. Just click on the start and end point of the gradient and give it different colors. You can also add a third color if you want to, just double click on your gradient line and you could give it, for example, a greenish color. And this I can create this gradient wave line in Inkscape. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.